Welcome to this South Africa, and today we are going to look at top 10 countries with the best education system in Africa. Number 10, Ghana. In Ghana, every citizen aged between 4 to 15 years must receive basic education which is free. Ghana operates on a 6344 system which is primary school 6 years, junior secondary or high school 3 years, senior secondary school 3 years, and senior high school entrance which is 4 years, and university's bachelor degree which is 4 years. Number 9. Egypt. When it comes to Egypt education, three cultural heritage plays a huge role. British secular, which is westernized, Egyptian, and Islamic, which are traditional. Egypt has an extensive education system that outstrips all other Middle East and North African countries and where even tertiary education is free. The compulsory primary education program follows kindergarten at age of four, primary school that begins at age of six, takes six years, and preparatory school another three years. During this introductory phase, pupils may enroll at state, religious or private schools by choice. Egypt has 72% literacy rate. Number 9. Libya All citizens have access to free primary education in Libya, with revenue from oil helping the government make it possible. After primary school, secondary education is then attended for 3 years. Libya has 83% literacy rate. Number 7. Algeria The structure of the education system in Algeria is based on 633 model. 6 years of primary school, 3 years of lower secondary school, and another 3 years of upper secondary school. Number 6. Kenya Kenya has been based on 844 system since 1985. Public education in Kenya is free, with 8 years of primary school, followed by 4 years of secondary school and 4 years of college or university. The country boasts of a great number of public and private universities and middle-level colleges. Formal schooling begins at the age of 6 with compulsory and free basic education running through the age of 14. Number 5. Namibia Education in Namibia is compulsory for 10 years, between the age of 6 and 16. There are approximately 1,900 schools in Namibia, of which 100 are privately owned. After successful completion of grade 12, learners are presented with a Namibia Senior Secondary Education Certificate. This certification can either be International General Certificate of Secondary Education, IGCSE, or the Higher International General Certificate of Secondary Education HIGCSE. IGCSE exam papers are set and marked in Namibia but moderated by Cambridge. High IGCSE question papers are set, marked, and moderated by the University of Cambridge in the United Kingdom. Number 4 Tunisia. Education in Tunisia system is divided in three basic levels that include basic education, basic education, nine years, secondary education, four years, and higher education, four years. Tunisian government has been investing heavily on the country's education system with 2002 Education Act emphasizing on the importance of ICT in the education sector.
Number three, Mauritius. The education system in Mauritius is categorized in four main sectors, pre-primary, primary, secondary, and tertiary. The country has a literacy rate of 83% of the population, which is very good. Children enter primary school at age of five, where they study for six years to work their certificate of primary education. Languages taught in Mauritius include English and French. Geography, history, mathematics, and science is also taught. Number 2. South Africa Today South Africa invests a considerable amount in education as it has ever since the end of apartheid. South Africa's education system is split into three levels, elementary, secondary and tertiary. Prior to 2009, the National Department of Education was responsible for higher education as well as secondary education. South Africa government spent about 80% of total budget on education, a relatively high figure for international standards, and one that represents about 6% of the country's GDP. Number 1. Seychelles. The country has about 95,000 residents, making it one of the smallest countries in Africa, and that can be an advantage, making sure that our citizens are educated. Success is the only country in Africa to reach the UNESCO Education for All goal set by the United Nations. In sources, today, a system of free education has been in effect since 1981, which is compulsory up to the age of 16 and free through secondary school until the age of 18. Students must pay for uniform but not for book or tuition. There are 33 public schools in the country. Thank you for watching this Africa. Make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss another video.